So we have just been teased with the first new creature that is going to be coming to Ark Survival Evolved in December for the Genesis Season Pass. I'm really happy that we, we, you know, we've been given this information this early. So hopefully that means we're going to be getting loads more mysterious mysteries building up to the DLC. So we know what types of dinos are going to be coming our way. I'm going to be going through all of the information from the new Community Crunch 198. And if you guys do have any idea what this creature could be, please let me know in the comment section down below. We don't even know whether it's tameable or rideable right now. But if you are hyped for the first Mysterious Mysteries of the Genesis Season Pass, smash that like button. Let's go for over 800 likes. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. And let's get in with the video. So this week's community crunch is quite short, but I'm going to be talking about the next sort of updates to come, um, obviously on from this as well, if you guys are interested in that. But Mysterious Mysteries Community Crunch 198 just been released now, introducing whatever this thing is. I have no idea what this could be, but to me it looks like, if I were to have a guess, some sort of bee, giant bee, I mean they've already got bees in the game, but maybe some giant wasp with that has this like, I don't know, it has huge fists and everything, so I can't even say what I think this is going to be. But it looks like you could maybe code some of this, so if anyone knows how to do that, um, then let me know. And they said, one interesting discovery, can anyone guess what this creature might be? Please let me know because I would love to find out what this could be. It would be fantastic if it is like a giant wasp or something that you'd be able to tame and that you'd be able to ride. Because it doesn't look like it's small in my opinion. It like I feel like if we knew it was going to be a small flying thing, then they would do loads and loads of them. And being so up close kind of gives me the feeling that this could be a rideable and tameable mount. But as I said for like the fifth time, let me know what you think this is in the comment section down below. Because the hype is really starting for the Mysterious Mysteries now and Genesis. We don't even know what the first DLC is going to be called, but this is the beginning of everything. So we will come back to that at the end of the video, but the first thing is on the horizon. If you guys want to know about PS4 transfers, the most up-to-date information is that enabling PS4 transfers is still the top priority at the moment, um, which links to why it happened, the hacks and exploits in the game. Abuse of game mechanics such as the tribe system have increased in usage on the official network. As such, we're working on implementing prevention and detection methods to lessen the impact that it has on the community. So really, what what happens within Ark is people abuse the game and then complain about the problems of the servers being down and transfers being disabled and stuff when the reason is you are like if you are exploiting in the game you're the reason why the stuff is being taken down so if you I know sometimes when you see an opportunity to be better than the others and exploit and stuff it's going to seem cool and everything but really if you don't want this stuff happening and you're someone that really enjoys playing the game then just play it legit like everyone else Else and prove your skill prove everything like that rather than cheating because otherwise you're gonna have things like ps4 transfers disabled and it causes a problem for everyone that plays for the, so for the rest of the community crunch really everyone's a little bit disappointed because it was great to see the first new creature announced but then all it was is talking about the evolution event which is going to be happening as normal friday the 20th until monday the 23rd as times two but Again, it is quite a short one, but it's big news that we do get the new, well, the brand new creature reveal. I, as I said for the sixth time, let me know what you think this is going to be. What we're going to do right now is go through some of the completed stuff from the quality of life catalogue that I've mentioned in a few other, well, that we've gone through in a few other videos. Then we're going to go through what's going to be planned for the next update, and then we will come back and talk a little bit more about this afterwards. So let's get straight on to the quality of life. So, if there's any things that people have been thought that need to be changed within the game, or anything that people feel like there needs to be an update for, these are the ones that have been done so far. So, lower the damage a Titan does to structures a little bit. Mate option for dinos instead of them running around on water, uh, on wonder, sorry. Add a struggle mechanic to get out of the bowler slash traps for players. Plant Y should have a weight slash size limit, or it should be adjusted since the quets can be trapped. Nerf the movement speed of some water dinos, such as the Manta, Moser, and everything like that. Now, this is going to be interesting because of the way that it worked with the flyers, but we'll see how it goes. Add five extra group ranks. Seems like it never got added. 
plant Z stuns for dinos. Um, the, uh, I can never pronounce this one right, but I'm going to go for the Megalena. Require so many narcotics, so that's been changed as a creature balance. Spyglass, uh, um, which is add a, a reticle enable key. Um, adjust Giga Rage so it's more difficult to activate. I completely agree with this one because the Giga just rages and rages way too much. Um, so I was, I'm sure that hasn't been changed like years ago. Um, lower the total um, time of the gas bags to Rhino levels. Allow bullets to stack to 100. This again is was a fantastic one. I don't know if that, I think that did actually come in an update. I wasn't too sure, um, but that really is a fantastic thing. Um, and then another thing that has been completed down here was show the stats of dinos in cryopods, which is great. And uh, so, yeah, they're the completed things that um, some will be an update, some will be coming and everything like that. There was actually a PC update that went live last night, which if we go and find that, we'll come back to the uh, we'll come back to the community crunch in a second. But I'll show you if you are on PC watching this video, what has come with that update. So as you can see, uh, yesterday night, I think the update went live. Fix the next exploit which they don't like to say what exploit they are because they don't want people finding more more people finding out what the exploit is and trying to make more of it or something fix the server crash when using the grapple hook buffed tech turret health by 50% to reduce to receive the new buffed health you will need to pick up and place the tech turrets so mainly the updates right now for all platforms is you know focusing on fixing all these exploits people don't want these exploits in the game and they're happening more and more and more and they need to get them removed so we have such a smooth launch for the mysterious mysteries which is this picture right here now i'm going to go through the archive stuff i'm not going to go through the new stuff because i've done that for separate videos but basically the stuff that is archived is the stuff that's going to be upcoming next for the quality of life updates so remove reset of mating intervals from craft Biopods. Owners and admins can only make alliances and should be logged into tribe logs. Allow industrial cookers and beer barrels to be inter uh, irrigated sorry, by wells and reservoirs. Um, enable grapples on aberration. Custom crosshairs or even customizable crosshairs. You might see some really cool changes here guys which is up next. Tech helmets should be made underwater clear uh, or should make the underwater clear. When wearing full tech armor, it should ignore gas slash radiation. Defense units should be harvestable. Option to disable desert titan on aberration. Tech teleporters underwater should not need to be replaced if you run out of element. Allow players to have a preset that they can apply for turrets. Clean up some hitboxes. A lot of dinos don't register on wings and stuff like that. Make brontos immune to knockbacks to better hold off points. Um, option to disable cryo sickness buff on PVE. Um, more configs in, in the game. Um, where are we? Smithy. Add ability to cut a color and rename and fix collision. Paint sprayer. Do not reset the selected color regions on weapon swap. Add extra level after ascending on the King Titan fight. Baby's footsteps should not be as loud as the adults. Currently, you cannot reload while on a dino because X brings up the dino inventory. This is just to do with the console specific. Tech dinos should not drop meat and hide rather than some metal and electronics. Remove the name pop-up for claiming a new baby. Mech pistol range should not have a shorter lifespan. Client option to disable tail movement swing. Gigabyte should be reduced um, to, the match that, uh, to match the area that he is biting. RG should always pick up friendly dinos over the player that is riding it. Give the unicorn color zones, um, add a max quality percent that the gacha items can drop, make mantis tameable again on the extinction map, insects should be able to breed, prevent color mutations on, co on, on, on color regions of dinos that don't exist slash display on said dinos, enable server config to increase amount of structures in an area, add other raptors to, uh, to be spawned or transferred into aberration, and finally, allow kangaroos to be transferred into aberration. So that is everything that you should be looking forward to that is coming to the game. Things that are being completed, things that are archived within the thing. But finally, the end of the video today, guys, I just wanted to mention, again, for the seventh time, it's probably more than that, 
what is this let me know in the comment section down below i'll be favoriting the biggest things that every you know the most like comments or the ones that i feel like could be true i'll be researching the different types of creatures you guys let me know on, um, on the internet and stuff and seeing what could match this the most drop a like guys let's hit that 800 like target subscribe if you're new to the channel genesis is getting closer Don't cut that. Oh. 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 Oh.